Hello everybody and welcome to a brand new, at least it's far as I know, brand new, as far as I've been aware, Super Metroid Airy. Now this hack, I don't know anything about it, I just found out about it on the forum. It's, it was released sometime this year, I'm not quite sure when, but somewhat recently. This is from the same person who made Oxide and Vino. And oh boy, I think I know why it's called Airy. So yeah, I have some pretty high hopes for this. This is... Oxide is one of my favorite hacks, so... We shall see. On his site, he described it like Oxide is like a mini hack, and then this one has a full hack, so... This one's... Probably... Hey there... Decora. Oh. You broke stuff. Oh, this is interesting. So yeah, I'm guessing the name is from... The... Airy-ish physics. It's kind of... Interesting. Kind of reminds me of being referred to as well. Kind of floaty. Do I even need this guy? I don't even know anymore. Anymore, I don't even know anything about this heck. Oh, hey. And I, yeah, I can't even do that. And that's the end. Oh, hooray. Fun stuff. Water? That's interesting. And. Oh, hey. <laughs> Hi. I, yeah, hi. There's nothing here. Go away. That's right, there was nothing there. Leave me alone. No, no. Good grief. Well, I found the big Metroid already. <laughs> yes, you are a bad Metroid. Go away. Go away. And the health alarm makes its wonderful appearance. And... Okay... Some weird stuff going on in here. Okay. Oh, I forgot to mention his name. The guy who made this is Cyclamen32. See, username he goes by, so... There's the, all these doors locking behind me. I don't like this. It's like I'm being pushed one direction. It's like, nope, can't go back from here. And this one. All these doors are locking behind me. Well, this is interesting. And an elevator. Some health would be nice. Just enough to shut this alarm off. And it's darker. Oh no. So yeah, I really don't know what to expect from this hack. If he th thinks that... I'm not going that way. If he thinks that Oxide is a mini and then this is a full... I mean, obviously I'm kind of guessing this one will be larger. Uh, this is a nice thing. Get the stupid alarm off. Oh, there's something up here. Oh, it is a morph ball. Morphine ball. It's always a good find. Super rapid fire. I can just hold the button now. That's fun. See, I don't know about these. Physics, I mean, they'll take a while to get used to. Just like any physics changes, really. They always. And more lock doors. Like, you can't go back any further. This is. Oh, bomb trees. You can always tell bomb trees because of haze. Because of haze. I don't remember how to get rid of it. You can, but it's not. Easiest thing. 
and he just disappeared entirely. Oh, hey. You have a strange room. You kind of just warped up after the statue broke. You can't even hurt me, can you? Swipe. Swipe! <laughs> well, that was... That bomb tree, though, has less health than the one in Oxide did. That Oxide one had a bunch of health, so... Yeah, I'm really not sure about the difficulty right now. I don't know... Oh, and the fog's gone away. Was there anything else? Nope. That's just an interesting room. Yeah, I really don't know anything else about this hack. It's very... Brand new to me. Which is a good thing. And as long as it's... <laughs> Hopefully this will be much better than the last hack I played. Is that why PR hack is pretty much the opposite of fun. Oh, stuck in door. Yeah, that stuck in door thing is It's annoying. It's not a hard fix, but it's not many people know how to fix it. And if you have a lot of vertical doors. It's easy to forget to do it for. Basically, there's when the door editor when you're putting in all the numbers. Basically, if you clone a door, you go to a door editor and click transfer properties or whatever. All those boxes. One of those boxes is called distance from door. If you hover your cursor over it, it'll show up. That's problem. And in that box, I think it's the second to last box, I'm not going this way. But in that box, you put in 0, 1, C, 0 for doors going up. And that will spit Samus out, or put her, or load her, however the technical term is, in the room above the door cap so she doesn't get stuck on the door. Smile kind of has it backwards. Because like uh, every other door, I think you can just do 8,000, I believe is the number you can do for whatever reason. I think that's it. I may be wrong there. But all the other three doors can share the same thing. Down, left, right, doesn't matter. But the up doors need the O1CO to work. But Smile has it so the doors going down get the O1CO and they don't really need that. So I don't know... If that may be something the original game does too with down doors getting that, but it wasn't. Kind of forgot to do it for the up doors as well, so. This palace is kind of nice actually. I do like seeing what other people can do with criteria tile 6. I cannot use this thing. It is like the hardest tile set for me to use. What's over here? Just as long as it's not red criteria. And there's something in here. Oh, hey. Is that... Good grief. This horizontal bomb jump could be super... powerful. Where are you? Oh, hey. My first missiles! Hooray! So give me 575? No. Just five, okay. So, not quite oxide. Not even close. <laughs> I think that awesome. Grapple Beam was also really early in oxide, so I don't have that yet. Oh well. Each hack is different, so. To judge them based on their own merits. Strange. 
it's over here. Powerbomb door. We are not going over there. This is... Gonna pass through this. That is interesting. And the locked door. How interesting. Okay, so... Got missiles though, so I've got some doors I could open up. Get some new stuff, maybe. And that's a nice. I kind of like the thing there. You don't. Normally, I guess, see that in hacks? Of course, you got. Normally, you don't get the big Metroid thrown at you in like the third room either, so. In fact, the only other hack I really remember doing that is Final Stand. At least right now. I'm sure there's more to have big Metroid early, but. Yeah, so far so nice. The jumping is a little bit weird. Same with the bombs blasting you all over the place, but... I think you can get used to this. It's all these defunct robots. Oh, hey there, little bird. Pretty bird. You're not the kind that screeches outside my room, so you're alright. Alright, I'll follow you down. You can break that wall down there, so I can find out what's down there. It would be interesting to see if somebody could turn the Decora into a boss. Of course, if somebody did that, maybe people wouldn't complain so much about not saving animals. And what do we have back here? Super missile block, great. So, not going that way either. Well, what else do we have? Could I practically... I went straight here without... I was expecting to explore around and said I guess I found the right way to go right away, so... See if I can... Do a little bit of exploring around the ship now. It's also kind of unusual to have to go right in a Metroid game, or a Metroid hack. You may not think of that very much, but like with a Mario platformer, you're always going right. And so in some of them where you go left, it's like really weird. The Super Metroid hacks are kind of like that, because almost all of them you have to go left to advance when you first start. And the map station. This is a weird looking or interesting. And this is quite large. So yeah, there was the missiles missiles. There was a missile door or two down there. Seems like all kinds of other stuff to explore too. A couple elevators. More dots. There's all kinds of fun stuff in here. And a nice little purpley blue sky. And all the way over here is my ship. Hey, I guess bomb trees will open this up. Hello, pirate. I, I'll i explore around first. Missiles will probably work, but I would rather look around first. Just in case. Oh, 
one of the weird lettuce leaf. I like the pellets on the lettuce leaves. They look like flying pumpkins, sort of. Plus, they're lettuce leaves, so... Sure, what's down here? A couple of fish! It's like a little fish pool. Or something. And... Apparently, there's nothing down here? This is just a pool of water that has a couple of fish? They just kill somebody's goldfish. Some space pirate pets, I guess. That is interesting. Maybe there's maybe there were these guys as pets or something. I don't know. Okay, what are we having this little dot? More missiles! Just what I wanted. And this looks highly suspicious, and that's because it is. So what is being sneaky down here? A power bomb door, which I can do absolutely nothing about. Pirates, which explode. More pirates, more doors. Actually, more missiles, that's cool. I am getting... Well, actually, let, let me check what's in this room. Please. I am getting close to the time, but... Mmm, more water. It's interesting. So yeah, I think we'll continue this off. Continue this off. We'll continue this in the next video, so thanks for watching, and we will see you for that.